guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Chanel, and if you're new here, go down and click the big red box, subscribe to this channel, and also click the bell so that you never miss when I post a video. So today is the day, and I finally revealed to you guys where I'm going on vacation. I did mention something um, about my last video, but I didn't want to um, say where, just because for this video, today I'm going to show you guys how I pack, what I pack to take with me to, drumroll please. Key West, Florida. I'm so excited. I've never been to Florida, let alone to the Florida Keys. I googled where's a really good place to go to vacation in the States, and one of the um, answers was Key West. So I did some research, saw what kind of things there were to do down there, and I decided to go to Key West. I'm only going to be down there for a couple of days, and I'm not going to obviously give out, you know, the details of where I'm staying, da da da. But um, basically, this is my vacation. I think I really deserve this vacation. And everything is already set. I leave. Today is Friday. I leave Sunday morning pretty early. But the good thing is that I get there in a good amount of time to still have a day and not lose a day to traveling. So without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get right into this video so I can show you guys what I packed to wear. I even talk about um, some of the things that I plan to do when I get down there. And also, at the end of this video, I'll get into my donation box that I'm going to be giving to my next charity, which I've also already chosen. And again, at the end of this video, I will reveal to you what that is. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into my list. Okay, so this um, bag right here I got from Amazon, and I saw Daisy Marquez use it, and I went and found it because of the other bag that I have, I couldn't find another one of, so I went ahead and got this one. So if you just open it up, it opens like this, and it does come with other compartments to like split it up, but I took those out so that I could fit my Vanity Planet brush head set in here, and this is what I use to clean my face every day, and then on this side, I have the Cup of Cup Banana bronze glow oil and I was on the hunt for like a really good bronze oil especially for my pictures that I'm gonna have taken down there but really just for every day just so I can have like a nice glow and I read whoa I read a lot of reviews and this one had a lot of constant reviews so I bought this one I also have in here my vitamin C microdermabrasion from the body shop in here and this is what I use when I want to exfoliate my skin which is like two times a week maybe three times when I'm feeling really um you know dirty I need to cleanse it out and sometimes I get lazy and I don't clean my face as often as I should twice a day and this just helps me you know play catch up basically and then I also have this Evo facial mist and I just got this from Sephora and I had my eye on it for a couple of days or really a couple you know months it's like $45 so I had to build my stuff up to get it but basically it just illuminates your skin protects it from environmental harsh factors so I and it really really does actually I mean I, I can attest to the illuminating part obviously the more I use it the more I will be able to tell about the environmental part but I've only used it one time I really bought it for um, vacations that's why I haven't been using it more than that and then that'll just go in here and on the side here is like my birth control pills and then up here is if you open this flap I have a headband for when I wash my face the water won't get in my hair and then this flap right here or not really a flap but this pouch right here it obviously zips open and shut and I have my African black soap in here now for this one this one I got at my Walmart and I actually like this one and um, I was like well I want another one but they did not have another one of course so that's why I had to go buy the other one with my skincare in it again and they both look the same they're black with gold zips this one's from Modella Modella and the other one was from Sam Tor. yeah Sam Tor. And as you open it up you see I've packed this to the max honey so first we're gonna go over the fact that I have four foundations with me because of the fact that my skin is like by different colors from the training event I went to and I don't know where I'm gonna be at as far as skin color and you know I might have to mix them I might have to um, lighten it up darken it up so that's why I have four different uh, options I have the Smashbox Studio Skin Maybelline Dewy and Smooth NARS All Day Luminous and then I have the Becca Luminous Foundation and then I have my uh, makeup sponge I have this 
Oh, I cannot talk today. I have this um, eyeshadow duo from Dose of Colors. I have makeup remover, the Clinique Melt or Take the Day Off. I have a primer from e.l.f. Hydrating Face Primer. I also have the NYX Dewy Finish for, um, you know, dry skin, which is what I do have. Even though it's become more um, combination as of late, but it's still pretty dry. I have my baking powder from Airspun. And then these three pouches, I have my brushes. I have, um, like, blush, bronzer, concealer, all that in here. And then in here, I have lip products. I bought the Modern Renaissance palette because I have yet to even use this. I think I used one color out of here, but I thought that vacation is a perfect time to use it. Then I have the Morphe uh, 35O palette, which is a constant whenever I do my makeup so I wanted to bring this and I also have the Jaclyn Hill palette this is the first one she did like relaunch it with the uh, different packaging so as you can see it's like dirty and stuff I don't really mind it it means you know I'm using it it was worth the money so I'm going to use that So that was it you guys, that's how I pack for like my skincare and my makeup. Of course I do have my luggage packed but I have a clothing haul coming up that should be uploaded within the next few days if it hasn't already gone up yet. I don't know which how I'm going to do it, which schedule I'm going to pick but um, that's pretty much all that I'm taking except for a few old pieces so I didn't think to like go through my entire luggage. I'm bringing bathing suits, obviously it's Key West. I'm going to have sunglasses, I have... Um, Basically, I think that's pretty much it. Obviously, shoes that I'm bringing. But now to kind of like transition into what I'm donating. Obviously, hair products, but also anything like DVDs, books, makeup that I don't use or haven't used. And the shelter that I'm picking is the Women's Shelter in Raleigh. And this shelter is special to me because I am from Raleigh, North Carolina. I was born and raised there. And I did move, obviously, to another state. But Raleigh has always been my home state in this obviously what I tell people when they ask me where I'm from I chose this shelter for that reason and also because even though I've never personally stayed in a shelter I know plenty of people who have family friends and I've already chosen one up here where I'm at so it's too easy to go get a box I will leave my PO box down in the description box so that if you guys want to send me products to give to them I will um, put it in the box and obviously I'm going to do a video showing what's all going to be in the box once I send it. I did get a pretty big box this time so it will take a few moments to, um, not a few moments but a few, I guess, uh, it will take quite a long time to fill up but obviously the video will not only be to show you guys what I'm sending but also if you do choose to send something you guys can see like hey it is going in this box you're going to see me tape it up, send it off, all that stuff. Um, and I think that is pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If I'm forgetting anything, I'll either put it in the description box or put it down in the comment section below. But I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.